we get into our agenda items, I believe we've got a couple of presentations and some comments that need to be made, Ms. Dukes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Good evening, Commissioners. Uh, Mr. Chairman, if we could start this morning, we have, or this afternoon, we start the meeting with, we have members of Ashbrook. Um, Commissioners, you all remember um, Ashbrook handled our hauling uh, for our debris removal after Hurricane Adelia, and then we also have members of the Boys and Girls Club. They'd like to make a presentation, but before we do that, if you all would like to, to give us an update on, on where things are right now, before you do that, um, you know, on behalf of staff and I, thank you all so much. Um, you all cleaned up our community incredibly fast. Some of us have been working events with Robin Pelletworks and Ashley for, for more than 20 years in this community, and I don't think that we've ever had a partner come in um, and just be the asset that you all have been, and so we are very grateful for that. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. First of all, my name is Matt Geary with Ashbrook. I'm one of the senior vice presidents. I've been with Ashbrook for 20 years. Um, first of all, I'd like to say thank you for the opportunity to serve the community. Uh, I've known Ashley for five, six, seven years now. Um, we've had the standby contract in place. It's never been used. But we're grateful for the opportunity to be here and, and serve as we did. Um, not just Ashley, but also public work staff. Your staff and team have all been very well, very organized, uh, great partners to work together. And I think that was part of the teamwork that helped get this project done as quickly as it did. Uh, just a quick update. And as you know, if you know, we've hauled over 677,000 cubic yards in the county alone. Um, we're in the process of wrapping up the last of the, the grinding at the public works facility. We hope to have about 95% of that done by the holidays. And we'll wrap up a little bit left after the new year. Uh, but once again, I appreciate it. this county is very large, lots of road miles. So it was, uh, it was definitely, um, it was good to work with your folks. Hello, my name is Sarah Perkins. I'm also with Ashbrook. I'm here representing our corporate foundation. So as Matt said, as we wrap up uh, the debris work at the end, of the, the end of the project, we like to give back to the community. So we see a lot of communities that have been impacted by disaster. We want to make sure that the communities we work in know that we are there for them year-round all the time, especially in the wake of a disaster. So I'm really excited that uh, in January we're going to be launching a national partnership with Boys and Girls Club. And in anticipation of that, I reached out to my contact and I said, we are working in Louds County um, post-Adalia. Were any of the clubs there affected? And unfortunately, one of them was. And so we were connected with Kristen and Brian, and I reached out to them, found out that the gymnasium, unfortunately, was destroyed, and we were happy to help out. So I'm here uh, announcing to you all and the rest of the community that uh, our partnership with Boys and Girls Club. Good afternoon, commissioners. Um, again, I'm Kristen Hanna with the Boys and Girls Club of Augusta. I've been there about 10 years now, and unfortunately, after Adalia, we ended up with about an inch of standing water in our gymnasium. We serve almost 1,000 children every day, and as you can imagine, a gymnasium is a pretty popular place for our children to be. Um, and we were stuck with a surprise in the year of $83,000 to fix that situation. Um, we have a wonderful insurance company, but they're not here to be a full, a full um, replacement of that. And the Ashbrook Foundation has graciously come in and allowed us to replace our floor over the Christmas break when the kids have a break from it as well, to the tune of over $50,000. Um, so I just would like to really thank them for prioritizing our community, for prioritizing our children, um, those that we serve at the Boys and Girls Club. You know, we represent a thousand children, but that's also over a thousand families in our community as well. Um, so just so thankful for their support. Thank you guys for choosing a good partner and a good contracted vendor um, and one that's going to turn around and give back. Thank you, Ashley. Thank you all. And... You know, I'm in marketing. So we're going to get a quick picture, if that's okay. Sure. If you guys will stand, we'll come in front. Y'all can stay where you are, okay. and we're going to line up here, if that works for you. I don't think that's going to work that the field wise will there used to come in we'll come Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> I appreciate that, Paige. I was trying to honor your time, but this is much better. Yeah, no, come on to the front, then. We'd love to have you. Okay, so we'll have 
Megan and Natalie, you tell us. Mission is safe.